Hi everyone. Um, I have been. Um, I just really feel in my heart that um, the Lord is really tugging in my heart to just to tell people that He is coming back soon. We may not know the day or the hour, but He is to come back really soon. Let's hypothetically say that He does come back ten years from now. Or not, 10 years is really not a long time, even though I feel like he's coming back sooner than we think. And um, I am not making these videos um, to share my, my rapture dream experiences um, because I love the Lord and I just want to do just something because He's he's been tugging in my heart to let people know to get their hearts right to him and to repent of their sins because he is soon to come and you don't want to be left behind and today I wanted to share with you all a video um, that um, that I had probably around in 2000, between 2007 and 2014 and um I don't remember the exact year, so that's why within those several year period, I do know I was in my 20s, and it was around that time. And um, and so I want to tell, show, tell you the dream. And so um, I was at an airport, and I was going on an international flight, and there were other people with me, and they all look like um, people from other countries. Um, in this um, dream, we were rushing to get to our terminal because um, we felt like we were going to miss our flight. We were uh, kind of running behind, and we thought we were going to miss our flight. And so when we got to um, our terminal, the lady that was working at, in that area, she told us um, that our flight was delayed. And so, when um, she told us that, we all kind of sat down and we were like, ooh, you know, we were kind of glad that we did not miss our flight. And so, um, then I asked the lady what time was this particular flight. And this, and then she said 3.45. And when she said 3.45, I woke up. And so she said 3.45, and I woke up. And may the Holy Spirit bear witness to this. Because when I woke up, and I looked at my, looked at my alarm clock, guess what time it was? 3.45 a.m. 3.45 in the morning. I don't know what that means. I know um, that um, number three, you know, spiritually, you know, represents wholeness, completion. I do not know what the number 45 means in particular, and I just pray for clarity from the Holy Spirit, and if there's um, anybody with any type of knowledge about the number 45, any believer on the Lord Jesus Christ that has some type of knowledge in this, you know, you can share share your thoughts or whatnot, um, but I do feel like this dream was kind of a rapture dream, and that um, the Lord was telling us, no, do, um, do not <laughs> be late for this flight that's about to happen. The fl and I feel like we were on bar, we're, we were on borrowed time and now the time is approaching. That flight had been delayed and now it's soon to come. And I don't know what that 345 means, but. I feel like our time is really near and it's really short and we need to be ready. 
we need to be ready to get our lives right with the Lord. And so, um, if there's anybody that's not saved out there, and if you want to receive Jesus as Lord, um, uh, you can always repeat this prayer after me. Heavenly Father, I believe on your son Jesus. I believe that um, he died for me. Heavenly Father, I just receive Jesus now. Jesus, come into my heart. I make you Lord and Savior of my life. I forget. Forgive me of all my sins. In Jesus' name, amen. Well, um, that's all I have right now. God bless you. Um, just pray and seek the Lord, you guys. and Just ask him for a dream. Ask him for a vision, something, so that he may show you personally and come to you. It says in the Bible, if you ask, you shall receive. Knock, the door will be open. Please, seek the Lord yourself on this. And let him reveal to you everything he wants to share with you. God bless you all. Have a wonderful day. Bye.